Every year, tens of millions of European citizens battle with migraines, depression, Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, and hundreds of other brain diseases. Brain disease costs Europe more than cancer and heart disease combined, over 800 billion euros per year. What we need is a radically new strategy. Brain diseases are different from other diseases. There are no objective lab tests and few effective treatments. Drug development is slow and expensive. So expensive, in fact, that many pharma companies have closed their labs. In the new Human Brain Project strategy, the first step is to federate patient data in hospitals all over the world, allowing researchers to search for patterns unique to the disease and unique to the patient. Once we can see where our patients land on a map of all diseases, we will be able to provide clear diagnoses and personalized treatment. In some cases, we might even be able to stop their diseases before they get off the ground. But that's only the first step. Our next job will be to configure our brain models with these disease signatures. We can then use these models to work out the best treatment, a revolutionary tool for researchers studying brain disease and developing new treatments. This is an effort that will go far beyond the Human Brain Project. The Human Brain Project's medical informatics and brain simulation platforms will be open to the whole clinical research community. Working together, we'll develop a better understanding of brain disease and faster, cheaper ways of developing new drugs. Most importantly, we may be able to provide safer, more effective, and more personalized treatments.